Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your Terry Brianna. If you don't know, now you know, so make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, in today's video, I'm showing you guys how I achieved this deep side part swoop long to my thong ponytail. Okay, you feel me? So, if you're interested to see how I achieved this look, then keep on watching. But please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hi, uh, so we meet again, my old friend. Here we are about to tame the beast once more. I'm here with freshly washed hair. Just finished blow drying it. And in order to get my 3C4A hair in this state, I detangled my hair with my Demon brush because it's super, super gentle on my curls. And I also use the L'Oreal Ever Cream Deep Nourishing Conditioner. So my hair is well moisturized throughout this style. You guys, I did not do this step in my last ponytail tutorial, but know that I'm doing it for the rest of my life. Make sure that you add a really good oil into your protective styles. Today, I'm using the 100% pure and natural castor oil. It's really good for hair growth stimulation, and it just really nourishes the scalp. So make sure that you have this on deck, okay? You're also going to need some clips to tame your mane. <laughs> and if you're wondering what blow dryer i use i use a jimmy blow dryer from amazon.com it was like 30 dollars and now we are about to put all this hair away and in order to part my hair you can use your nails like i do because you know i'm gonna get that 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 or you can use a brush cell comb okay um basically i'm just sectioning my hair off into halves because i got too much hair okay to be doing everything at one time like no i need sections okay don't ever think that just because i got these brazilians in my scalp that i'm bald headed okay no i got it out of here so yeah that's what i'm doing right now just sectioning off my hair as you know as you feel me make sure you like this video <laughs> see i'll do that in there okay anyways so now that your hair looks a little something like this, you know, business in the front, party in the back, we love that. Um, we are going to go and section our hair once more again, okay? Because we are about to, I know, don't kill me, don't unsubscribe, don't do none of that, but we're about to flat iron our roots. Um, yeah, this is the flat iron that I'll be using today. I have no idea where it's from. It's my grandmother's, but it's really, really good. It gets hot in like two seconds and like it, it also steams your hair if you want that but i don't have that setting on right now but yeah i'm just flat out in my roots because we want this ponytail to be sleek as fuck you know like i want to slay so i'm doing really big sections you know i'm not doing the chase method or none of that i'm just simply getting it a little smooth and then i'm gonna take a bristle brush okay and i'm going to brush the hair into a ponytail shape and i'm gonna take the lovely got to be hairspray okay we're gonna spray the hair like crazy brush it once more so it's super duper slick and then you're gonna get your blow dryer i have it on low speed and medium heat and we're just gonna blow dry our hair until it gets stiff spray some more if need be blow dry some out and you want to keep blow drying until it's dry and then you should have your hair molded into a ponytail shape without any scrunchy or anything like that okay and basically i'm just going to be repeating these steps over and over and over again until i get all my hair nice and molded so i'm gonna fast forward let y'all listen to some tunes you know and i'm gonna be back when my hair is mostly molded and it's time to do the swoop and the side part, okay? Then get me underway Right up to the side of my mountain Until 
a few things that you guys just saw me do. One, I took out my baby hairs on my left side because I'm going to fleek the fuck out of them later. And the got to be spray makes them hard. So I wanted to make sure that I sectioned those out. Two, I created two side pieces just to frame my face and add some pizzazz to the style. That's definitely optional. If you don't want to do it, you don't have to. And three, I did my deep side part. Place your part wherever you want to. And yeah, now I am just finishing up, smoothing my hair out, flat ironing it, and doing all those same steps that, that I did earlier. But now I'm starting to create the swoop, okay? This was the hardest part of the entire freaking style. Like, it's hard to make your hair lay in a way that it's not used to laying. But, you know, just keep doing it. Spray as much as you have to. Brush as much as you have to. Blow dry as much as you have to. And definitely I would use the back or the end of the rat tail comb to smooth down your hair. Because it really does help. But... Yeah, also be sure not to get any of the spray in your eyes or on your forehead because it can irritate the skin and definitely irritate your eyes. So be careful of that. But yeah, literally, I don't know how to explain exactly what I did. So, you know, just keep watching. If you have any questions, make sure to leave it in the comment section down below. Oh, also, any styles you guys want me to try in the future, comment those down below as well. Y'all know I love changing my hair up. So, yeah. Yeah. Passenger side of his best friend's ride
All right, bitches. So, unfortunately, right here, my camera died on me. The disrespect was at an all-time high, but um, during that time, I slayed my edges and I braided my hair down. Y'all know how to do that. It's common sense, so don't be too mad at me, but now it's time to add the hair. This is the same hair from my last ponytail video, so if you want to see what bundles literally just look in the description box but you can also you know do your girl a favor and check out that video as well but i'm just gonna get a rubber band that came on the hair to tie that hair to my braid and then i'm going to use bobby pins to keep the hair in place as i wrap the hair up the braid super duper self-explanatory so i'm gonna let y'all watch this entire situation i'm gonna come back when we are at the root of my braid wrapped all the hair i'm just going to take the end of the band and take that little piece of hair and literally wrap it around all of the bundles i used two bundles also if you're wondering this is going to secure the ponytail so once you're done doing that you want to take the end of your rat tail comb and literally tuck the hair all around the band on the scrunchie that you use to make your ponytail because that's going to make sure that it does not move at all and this is how the ponytail should be looking so far now what I'm about to do is take an even larger amount of hair, comb it out, spray it with got to be and blow dry it and that is going to shape my ponytail. It's also going to, you know, add some pizzazz to it and make it look super clean and professional. And once it's done, you know, we're going to look like a baddie, pretty poo. <laughs> result this is how the hair looks you know had to do my makeup real quick um if you're interested to see this beat literally go look at my last video also if you want to see how i achieved the high ponytail version of this hairstyle also go click the link it will be up here somewhere or it will definitely be in the description box below but yeah you guys that basically wraps up this video this tutorial you know, I hope you guys enjoyed every minute of it. If so, please give me a like and a thumbs up. We are almost at 20,000 subscribers, okay? And I'm really trying to hit that before we go into 2020. So, with that being said, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe if you're feeling the key. And I know you are, okay? So, I'll see y'all in the next video. Mwah. All I ask for you to keep it real.